Welcome to Chef Alley's Farm Fresh Kitchen. Join us as we meet from the land of Kansas members and explore new recipes using local Kansas ingredients and products. Good Thursday morning. Welcome back to 13 News this morning. Chef Alley's Farm Fresh Kitchen is here. Mm -hmm. A beautiful array of fruits and nuts and brown sugar. We eat with our eyes, Allie, and mm, today's <laughs> feature looks absolutely amazing. And we're jazzing up something that needs a lot of jazz. It right? does mm -hmm. need a lot of jazz. And so what we've set up here today on behalf of From the Land of Kansas is a breakfast oatmeal bar. Okay. And yes, oatmeal gets a bad rap. I personally don't like it either, but this is a whole new ball game because notice we're using steel cut What's oats. What's the difference? Okay, so this is actually even more nutritious because they take the whole oat and they just cut it into pieces. Okay. So it's chunkier in texture, but we've discovered that once we cook it, especially in an R2D2, Instead of being all gloppy and sticky, mm -hmm. it gets super creamy. Mm. So it's wonderful. And so you can cook a big old batch up in R2-D2. If you don't have a pressure cooker, you can use your slow cooker overnight. So all night long, that wonderful aroma is wafting all through the house. Mm -hmm. When you get up, you can set out your toppings, create this for your kids. So what I like to do, and of course with the big slice apples, they make it really handy. If you don't have time to put out your fruit and your nuts and all that, you can just grab a jar of their big slice apples. My family loves these. There's all different flavors. And so what I typically do is I go to my red solo cup. And so these are called oatmeal shooters, okay. um, oatmeal shooter cups. And so you can see the texture is um, real nice and creamy. It actually looks chunky, but it's creamy. And so it's cool to make up a whole batch because this reconstitutes super easy through the rest of the week. And how long does it take to make in the pressure cooker, by the way? So in the pressure cooker, on your stove, it's probably going to take you between 20 and 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. In your pressure cooker, it takes eight minutes with a five minute natural release. So that's why we want to make it up ahead of time. Mm -hmm. It takes a little bit of time, but it's worth it when you can have these the rest of the week. Okay. And then it's fun to just make it creamier with a little bit of um, yogurt if you want. And then you can add the big slice apples right on the top. And then for a little bit of crunch, that's what I like to do. And then you can send these right out the door with your family. Give them a spoon. I better not give them that one. Give them a spoon and out the door they go. Looks so they have an oatmeal easy. shooter cup. And yes. they can just doctor it up, you know, have the kids doctor it up in any yeah. brown sugar, pecans, chocolate chips, if you want to go that way. Exactly. My mm -hmm. boys like to use the Hildebrand Farms uh, strawberry milk with the bananas mm -hmm. to give it a strawberry banana um, flavor. So there's any way you can use nut butters, you can use maple syrup. There's lots of different ways. Toasted coconut makes it crunchy on the top. So I I have found this to be a really great way to um, give my family something warm when they're headed out the door to conquer the world. You know, breakfast, <laughs> I can speak for myself and a lot of people around here, breakfast is the most important meal of the it day. It is, because we have broken the fast, we need to get something nutritious in there, and it's nice to have something warm. And also, I might mention, you can visit Grandma Horner's store, it's just west of Topeka on I-70. Mm -hmm. Really fun place to visit and also to watch how they um, package all of their products. You can watch through the big glass window and see that. So um, visit From the Land of Kansas. It's shop.fromthelandofkansas um, is our website for all of the From the Land of Kansas products. Okay, my guess here, once the crew gets here and to, to try this stuff, the brown sugar and the chocolate chips are going to be the first ones to go. I think they'll be able to say, I now like oatmeal. You, hey, Steel cut oatmeal. You it's the do deal. You got to do what you got to do, don't you? <laughs> That's right. All right, uh, your website. <laughs> for the recipes. Yes, go to chefalleys.com, click on the big red button that says recipes, and you will find this and many other from the land of Kansas recipes right there for your convenience. Allie, thank you so much. You bet. We'll be right back. <laughs> Make sure to tune in the second and fourth Thursday of every month to meet more from the land of Kansas members. Remember, visit fromthelandofkansas.com to explore and find Kansas foods, products, and services.